my brother goes through bread at the dinner table like crazy, so it's like a joke. So, the waitress brought some more bread. I'm gonna go sneak in his room right now and just place it in his room. Good morning, H3 Cruisers. I'm out here on the balcony. We just woke up. I got a cool time lapse coming in. Uh, had my phone sitting out there. I went back to sleep and left it. Time lapse came out pretty cool. Uh, probably show a little bit of that here for you guys. But I'm coming back in the room because we got to get a shower uh, taken care of. But I wanted to tell you something that happened last night. So last night we came back to our room and we noticed a little envelope, oops, sorry. Noticed this little envelope by our door, or at least on the inside. Opened it up and it was from our stateroom steward, uh, Ryan, and it had two cards in it. $50 spa credit and $100 photo gallery credit, which is amazing, because that's $150 in credit. And then I happened to notice that when I went, um, to my account, the money I've spent, it, while it was charged, I have way more. Found out had a hundred dollars of credit added onto my account from someone I don't know who. Um, I'm guessing someone with Carnival. I don't know, but it's awesome. We got about two hundred fifty dollars in credit when we were looking at spending almost nothing. Because literally, I spent twelve dollars. Now, I've spent seventeen eighty five, and that was like the room credit amount already before the other hundred. So I didn't even touch the other hundred or the forty I put. So that's pretty awesome. But um, I think I have like a hundred twenty something left now. But we are officially in Cabo, as you can see behind me out our window. It's beautiful out there we're officially here we're gonna go out we don't have you know budget for out there on land too much all of our money is for on board so we will be getting um, plenty of photos which I'm excited about we'll be also getting uh, a spa package for at least one of us for the beautiful sleepy head over here that doesn't want to get up and take a shower but I love her she deserves a spa credit so I'm all for that and my hair is a total mess right now because I literally just got out of bed for the second time today. But let's go out and really enjoy our day. Hopefully today is going to be a lot more entertaining than yesterday's video because obviously a lot of the shots were in the room. And it was a sea day. It was a relaxing day. So a lot of the time we kept coming back to the room. And I wasn't too focused about up there. We have this beautiful balcony with an amazing view. And I can't really complain about that. So might as well enjoy some of it so yesterday yeah we went to trivia we went and did you know a couple things on board but we were mostly here so definitely awesome someone's trying to call me and i'm going to decline yep so anyways let's get on with our day we're gonna go take a shower and then we'll take you guys on land First thing when you walk off, you'll notice uh, plenty of shops, senor frogs, plenty of music and alcohol over there. Lots of people that are trying to get you on little excursions, go water taxis and as they call them, get you out to the beaches and all sorts of other stuff. So as I mentioned, uh, we're keeping a low budget. So I am personally on Cabo trying to get to the beach without spending a single penny. Brittany, on the other hand, she decided it was too hot outside, so she decided she wanted to stay on the ship and relax, and that's what she's gonna do. So, me personally, I'm gonna go find the beach, and I'm gonna get there no matter how long it takes me. Um, right now, it's about one o'clock, and we're gonna see what time it is when I get there. I gotta check the time, I might be off a little bit. Let's see, oh, 1.30. It is currently 1.30, I just got to Cabo, and I just want to enjoy the beach a little bit. So, let's see how long it takes me to get there. So, I'm still walking, going to get there, but it's funny because I had someone stop, 
and asked me if I wanted to buy some. And of course I said no, because I'm keeping my budget at zero. In fact, I didn't bring any cash off the ship. I left it all on the ship. That way, I can't spend money. Hopefully that doesn't get me in trouble. But, he's, when I said I didn't bring cash off the ship, he's like, I can give it to you for free. I go, yeah, that's not fishy at all. I'm good. And kept walking. So after a lot of walking, I am almost there. Thanks to Google Maps, of course. Because without Google Maps, I probably would not have made it here because I wanted to come down to the beach where I can see the ship. And hopefully there's not too much wind because I'm not using my microphone. I don't want to lug too much off the ship besides the phone and the mount that it is in right now. So let's get down here and see what we got. Okay, so as I mentioned earlier, I was gonna walk to the beach. I didn't take any cash off the ship. All my money is still on the ship, on my account. And I spent zero dollars to walk from where we got off the ship all the way around the main, or marina and down into this area. I got a great view. There's a yacht right there with a helicopter on the back. That person has a lot of money and they like being down here. Because they were here two years ago when I came down here. And then you got the beautiful view of the ship. And get to enjoy the ocean go down to the ocean, swim. Um, if you do have money, they do have uh, water taxis that'll take you out to the arch way out there. They also have jet skis that you can rent, which would be pretty awesome to do the jet ski. Maybe in December I'll get lucky enough and be able to do that. It'd be kind of cool to take the jet ski out and go around the ship uh, with the jet ski. But not a single penny spent today. Of course I'll be spending some money on the ship because yesterday I found out I have $100 in cruise cash that I didn't know about. So we gotta spend that because it's either use it or lose it because I don't get that back. So while recording on the beach, this one comes up and finds me. The 21 year old. And you got Doreen, who's very excited about your license plate. Yeah, I want to see it looks pretty. Oh, uh, uh, frame, photo frame. For our road photo. So, yep, definitely enjoy the beach here and still haven't spent anything. And I even brought my soda off the ship. <laughs> I gotta touch it. I know you like it, Nathan. Ah, it's actually quite toasty out here. The sun is bright. A little too bright for me. Sure. So that completes my trip to the beach. This, I didn't pay for. My stepmom actually uh, got me this. It was a two for one deal. So she got one, got one free. Got me one as well. But check this out. Second here. Carnival Splendor back there. Pretty awesome. Now, on my way back to the ship, because it's about a half an hour trip back, and I don't want to be late, so better start walking, right? So I made it back from Cabo. I'm back on my amazing balcony that I love with this amazing view around me. I'll tell you, I walked around a lot today. It was a lot of fun. Like I said, I didn't take any money with me on board, or well, off board. Everything was still on board. I didn't spend a single penny, because I didn't have a penny. And I walked to the beach, enjoyed the beach, ran into uh, family. My stepmom bought a two for one margarita, so I had a margarita. And then walking back, I ran into some more of the family, and ate some lunch, and I didn't even pay for it, because what happened is I was walking by, they stopped me, because they ordered way too much food, so I had to come be the garbage disposal. So yeah, I ate lunch, had margarita, and enjoyed Cabo, and I didn't see, or didn't spend a single penny, which is pretty awesome. Now, for most people, that's not going to be possible like that, but you can go enjoy the beach, come back on the ship, and not spend any money. So, now that I'm back on board with uh, this great view around me from my own balcony, 
we're getting ready because, well, it's about 5, 10, 5, 20, something like that right now. And we got to head to, uh, we got to head to uh, dinner. And Brittany wasn't feeling so well last night, so we left a little early from dinner before they could sing to us. So, they're going to do it tonight. Now we're off to, oh, 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 look who just came out his balcony. Well, I can't show you because it's family friendly. I can't show you. What did you do because it's family friendly? Hold on, hold on. Let me, you can see my face as I see what his non-family friendly thing. Wow. <laughs> Oh, that's great. I wish I could show you guys, but you know what? Cover up the two S's. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys, because I'll make it family friendly by not showing you the whole thing. <laughs> that is great. Oh, we know the second one's true. He's got a second message. I'm not even gonna try to edit that no, one out. No, it's for Wolfgang and Logan, because I know they'll wear this. Oh, you got that from them? Yeah. I thought you were going to wear that first one. I mean, I wear them. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go Rambo in that booty. That, that's, that's, how, uh, that's how Nathan's going to get a girlfriend on the ship. With that one. Right. No, I, I got it. I got so, it as a gag gift. Wow. We are back. ten bucks. I'm like, nah, five. <laughs> well, ten one bucks. downside about this balcony... I see people up here. Well, we're going to head to dinner, and uh, we're going to bring you along for a little bit because they're going to sing, too, after, yo, know, once it's dessert time, that is. See, Nathan just comes right over in our room from our balcony. Oh, oh, too dark. So, off to dinner. One, two, three. Happy anniversary to you. Happy anniversary to you. Happy anniversary, happy anniversary, happy anniversary to you. That's so weird to say. <laughs> Hopefully a lot more to come. <laughs> okay, so I just ran back up to the room because everyone left dinner and the waitress came back with a bunch of bread. Now, the reason she came back is she thought someone wanted more bread at the table, which is my brother. Sorry, I just kind of ran, so I'm like breathing heavily. Anyways, my brother goes through bread at the dinner table like crazy, so it's like a joke. So, the waitress brought some more bread. I'm going to go sneak in his room right now and just place it in his room. Out the balcony door. Oh, bear with me, it's gonna get a little dark in here. Oh, 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 it's dark. Hold on. Thought I hit the light switch. Oh, hit a light switch. Not the right light switch, though. Hold on, hold on. Okay, so I'm in their room with some bread. Hopefully they don't come in the door. I'm gonna put that there. Butter. Now I'm out. Should I leave the light on? No, I'll turn the light off. Out the door. Balcony off. I was never here. Back to my room. Ha <laughs> ha. So just made it back from a mission. Brittany made it back to the room. I'm huffing and puffing. I told the lady that had those, that, those mustaches on her uh -huh. door. I was like, that's the only way I found my room that earlier. <laughs> There's she your phone. Was, I need really to see if Nathan's angry. coming yeah, back. Let's see if Nathan's coming. Hold on. So Ryan told me there was a gift for Nathan. So I'm curious. I'm curious. I want to see. I want to see what it is. Probably not. Oh. <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> I can't stop laughing. That's great. <laughs> you 
tell him? <laughs> Thought this was our secret, Nick. No. Actually, what happened, bro, is everyone left, and the waitress came back with more bread for you. <laughs> she's, like, where, she's like, where is he? Well, that was the waitress, uh, the, you know, the one that usually gets the drinks for you. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys, we've made it back to bed. We're laying down, well, after we finish our whole pepperoni pizza that we both ordered, which tastes amazing right now. But since the last video, obviously there was things we did that we didn't record, so we went to the playlist production of 88 Keys. That was pretty awesome. I like that. Um, we checked out the nightclub, but there was no one there, so we skipped that. We went up top to the front of the ship uh, to the little secret spot. I think we caught someone trying to have Rumpy Pumpy, and we kind of ruined their mood. I feel bad, because we walked up there. Rock out with your... out. <laughs> Yeah, we walked up there. It's a secret spot that if you don't know where it's at, it's almost impossible to find if you don't know about it. So we went up there, and it's pitch black, and there's two people sitting on a bench. And we totally killed their mood. Oh, you scared the crap out of me. Yep, they scared us. And then, uh, yeah, because we came out, and there was like two people just like shadows over there. And then uh, it's pitch black out there there except for one light and we noticed uh what we believe was an eagle flying back and forth at the front of the ship uh, it was pretty cool uh, what else did we do Just after the play was walked around the spa. um we walked around the spa area because uh we met up with uh, two other passengers who are part of our facebook group um chelsea and alexander alexander's got a spa room so he kind of gave us a tour of the uh spa area and then hung out with them and yeah, we had a lot of fun tonight but that completes tonight's video so for the sake of my redhead hit that thumbs up button if you like this video oh excuse me dang pizza hit that thumbs up button if you like you got thumbs. Hit, some before bed. <laughs> You're welcome. hit that thumbs up button if you like this video and also make sure you smash that subscribe button to stay up to date on all the other future videos and obviously I am zoomed in on my face because as you see, my red neck and shoulder, yeah, I'm not wearing a shirt, so I'm keeping you to my eyeballs here. So that's it, guys. I'll see you in the next vlog. Thank you for tuning in for the last three days of cruise videos, uh, even though they're not uploaded on a daily basis because the internet sucks. But there are still many more days to come, so check them out, and I'll see you guys in the next vlog.